Cavaliers ranked in the NBA last season. First in scoring. First in assists. And they also were number one in team shooting percentage. A very impressive offensive group. But when you get down to it, I mean, the identity of this club is that they score the ball. Number one in the league, they have so many ways to hurt you, and that seems to inspire them with confidence every single game. Down to five on the shot clock, and it's blocked. This one for three. Dinwiddie with the rebound. Boy, but he was close, Kevin, to making the defense pay for lackadaisical coverage there. Yeah, he had a really good look. I mean, he will knock that down more often than not. Now here is Horford. Rebound by Roberts. About seven seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Left side, Harris. Right side, Jefferson. The fader. That is good. And the Cavaliers lead by five. We've got 13 seconds left here in the opening quarter. Here's Dinwiddie. And he was fouled on the way up. Two free throws now for him. First trip to the free throw line for him in this one. And of course, last year's superb free throw shooting above 90%. And guys, the numbers don't lie. I mean, he was such a reliable presence at the free throw line all throughout last season. Boy, that was solid. I'll tell you, he's one of the best there is up there at the foul line. Here's Roberts. That misses would have counted had it gone in. Costume. It's Halloween. Well, up to this point, a closely contested game as we start the second quarter. What stands out to you from the Cavaliers in this one? And I'm just so impressed with the long range shooting. Yeah, they have really lit it up from outside. Yeah, the sharp shooting from deep, a big part of their lead, and they're playing with confidence and shooting it well. They've got Trey Burke. Horford is out there with Andy Dukumbo. And it's Dinwiddie in at the two spot. So that's the Hawks five. And so he earns a trip to the line. Officials saw the contact and he'll shoot two. Cleveland shooting their second and third shots at the line right here. And he makes the first. Good on both. The Hawks trail by five. Pass to Burke. Pass to Dinwiddie. Thompson against Horford. Shot clock at six. And that one's good. Here's Roberts. Quiet so far offensively. Searching for his first points of the game. And around a minute gone here in the second quarter. Feeds it to Middleton. Can't get it to go. So Atlanta will take it the other way. Here's the dish to Burke. He feeds it to Horford. Here's Dinwiddie. He's covered by Thompson. Here's Irvin. Horford trying to free himself up. Can't tie it up as that one's no good. Cleveland's gone 4-6 from outside the arc tonight. A nice shot by Roberts. Roberts got his first bucket in this one. And you can feel the, the pattern of this game, guys. They're, they're working it inside, dominating in the paint, getting good shots at will. Well, four of their last five baskets, guys, have been of exactly that variety. Fades away. It's rebounded by Cleveland. Did you see his balance there, guys? Really faded away. I think that's why he missed. The screen from Thompson. And Roberts kicks to Middleton. Bangs home the trifecta.
now it's a seven-point Cavalier lead. That's like a layup for him. He's just wide open out there. And for those of you just joining us, we're almost two and a half minutes into the second quarter. And now Harris running the floor all by himself. Agility leads to thievery there as he's got his hand in there to get the steal. Intelligent play to immediately start the break. Plays like that are telling the story of this game for me. so far, Clark. They cannot afford to hand over any more easy points like that. Time call here. The Hawks decide to talk it over. He needs to get them back into a flow offensively. You know, things have gotten stagnant for them, and they're starting to force some of these shots. And that can snowball on you. One guy takes a bad shot, then another guy does, and then you're missing back-to-back-to-back -to -back -to -back shots. All of a sudden, you have no rhythm, and you're self-inflicting wound. Here's what Atlanta's going with right now. Payne comes in for Al Horford. And it's Kent Bazemore in for Dinwiddie. The jump hook, and again it's Cleveland. Boy, I tell you what, nice little run here that they're going on. Now the story is points in the paint, Clark. I mean, they're getting point-blank shots every time down. They set the pick. Work to to Bazemore. This is the paint. To halt the run. And once again off the mark by Atlanta. You know, so many games are decided by which team wins the rebound battle. And that's held true in this one so far, Steve. And even if it's only a modest advantage that they have in that category, it's still a significant. to tighten up defensively, guys, because they're really giving up way too many open looks. Clark, some tough offensive sets. They want to turn it around. Yeah, they need a basket just to regain some momentum here, Kevin. Defensive foul. Jonathan Harris. That's his first personal foul. First team foul. Here's Payne. He's had some playing time, but no scoring yet from him. That's good. Here it is again. On a lot of their possessions this first half, they've established great position inside. Yeah, getting the ball into the post should be their first option every time down. Force the defense to adapt and adjust. And Roberts kicks to Harris. Down low. Here's Thompson. Got him with the bump fake, but couldn't finish. The Hawks trail by 11. Here's Honda Takumbo, and the shot falls short this time. I think he was surprised by how much space he had there and just rushed the shot a little bit. And Trey Burke. Gets the whistle that time. And Cleveland Thomas. making a change here. Thompson. Irving. Here's Parks. Onto Takumbo pulls it in. Onto Takumbo's got his third rebound tonight. Now here's Burke. He's covered by Thompson. Here's Baysmore. Here's on to Takumbo, and there's the bucket. Stay with it on the offensive glass, getting it done. He got a great read of where that miss was going, and that allowed him to be the first guy to it and get the putback. And here's Irving. He has seven. Here's the screen. He kicks it to Thompson. 
Six to shoot. Yes, and it's Irving picking up the assist. Irving's got six assists now in the game. Boy, they look helpless defensively. Now here's Burke. He's covered by Irving. And Bazemore kicks to Honda Tacumba. Three-pointer. Bazemore misses. I like the defense, guys. Really getting a hand up and challenging shots. Yeah, Steve, lurking on that shot, and that was a tough one. Outside Irving. Shoots from 12. And a big bounce off the rim, but it sinks right in. Irving's got the lead up to 13 now for Cleveland. Atlanta's gone one of four from three-point range in the second. Not a whole lot dropping out there for them. Time call here. The Hawks decide to talk it over. And as with any timeout at this point of the game, important to go over the strategies that are working and those that are needed in terms of adjustments. And, of course, the opportunity, guys, to get hydrated with Gatorade before coming back out of the floor. We've seen some good action so far, and there's, there's more of it to come. Yeah, this game has been physical, it's been fast, it's been high-paced. So anytime you're in a situation like this where it's really a hard-fought game, critical to keep yourself hydrated throughout. I like the way they've played here in the first half. Just an intelligent floor game, getting good shots. Numbers certainly back that up. They're shooting a much better percentage. Here's Bazemore, and they wasted no time getting those three points back. Bazemore's got his first three points of the game. James outside. There's the feed to Thompson. Outside Irving. Kicks to Thompson. On the wing, James. He's got eight. Atlanta needs to do a better job guarding against LeBron. He has eight points, and he's got two baskets from out in three-point land. I'm sure they'd like to get him a few more of those, so look for them to run some screens for him, try to pop him open. Locks making a switch here. Another trip to the strike for him, and I tell you what, a little bit of a different feel here in the second quarter. A little more banging going on. This team is never afraid to get physical. I think they enjoy this style of play. Stolen by Thompson. LeBron drives in to the left side wing. Outside Irving to the paint. Here's Parks, and he throws it down hard with one hand. Well, they ran a nice play there, Kevin, to um, set up the easy dunk. Yeah, he got help from his teammate and ran his man right straight into the pick. Yep, and that's the offensive player's job. That's Run right. him into the screen. And it was a great pick, too, Clark. I mean, he, he may have lowered his shot. over a little bit, but he got him pretty clean. Burke kicks to Payne. And the pass to Burke. Feeds to Payne. And there's the call out. That's foul number two.